Hey collectors, here is part 2 of the set review for Soul River Legacy of Kane action figures by BBI based on the PlayStation 1 game by Eidos. The box set contains a base for Kane that has his nameplate. This base is also the pillar that you can see in the gameplay which is being corrupted as represented by the mold which surrounds it. There are also this power surge which is represented by this purple effects which you can find on both sides. It also has the sword of Cain which has a very good sculpting of a skull on its handguard. The figure stands around seven and a half inches tall. He is fully posable and if you look closely with the paint details on his face, you can see that it simulates veins and the muscle sinews. Also, you can put Kane on either of this peg and display him with this base as his backdrop. Here is Kane with the other figures. Definitely, he is a little bit taller and wider compared to Lieutenant Rachel, but he is bigger than both figure of the resurrected Rachel. For the last figure of the Soul River set, here is Duma. He stands around 12 inches tall and comes with his face mask. This is the mask of Duma. It has a lot of sculpt and paint details. Even if you look it on hand, you will be amazed at how BBI did it. But unfortunately, it cannot stay on securely on his head because of how the hair of Duma was sculpted. So I suggest you put something inside it to secure it or a blue tack. Here is how the mask and headgear looks like when you place it on his head. I post the head looking downward so it will not easily fall off. Because of how the hair is sculpted, it constantly pushes the headgear off his face. So be very careful and if I were you, I would just put something inside of it so that it will not constantly fall off. And here is a special feature of Duma. If you pull out this part, it will reveal another face sculpt, but this one is a battery compartment. So Duma has a light up eyes. Unfortunately, I don't have any batteries to show you guys, but also it leaves this part of his face hollow. So be very careful because there are protruding parts that you might break if ever he falls down. As it is, the two parts, the battery compartment and the mass, always constantly fall apart because it has no locking mechanism. And here is a group shot of all the figures released by VBI for the Soul River Legacy of Kane toy line. For size comparison, here is Duma with the 9-inch Lucifer from Dark Alliance toy line by Art Asylum and Buzz Lightyear 12-inch from Takara Tomy. Here is Kane compared to Buzz Lightyear from Bandai, Homelander from NECA, Tony Stark from Marvel Infinity Saga Hashbro, and Batman from DC Collectibles The Animated Series. And finally, here is Rajel with Rebel Tech All Might, Mafex Justice League Superman, SH Figure Arts Kid Krillin, and Snoopy from Memory Lane. And with that, thank you all for watching. See you again next video.